Hi gang, next uh, video for your Geography Interactive Notebook and the next thing we're going to talk about is um, the continents and how they move and the story of Pangea. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and present this. So for, oh, let me go ahead, I skipped, skipped a piece here. Give me one second, you guys. Didn't mean to skip a piece. All right, so in your Interactive Notebook, all right, you are going to be in this. Okay, so it's going to be in this one here. Okay, so you're going to cut it out. There's two things to cut out. You're going to cut out this one that has the numbers and the letters, and then this one which has the names. So this is what you have in your notebook right here. Okay, and you're going to glue one on top of the other so it opens up. All right, so the top one is going to be where the numbers and letters are, and then the bottom one is going to be where all the names are. Okay, so you're going to color this. Make sure you color it nice. All right, and don't make sure that you can still read everything. So this is going to be, um, you're going to glue this right to the page, and then you're going to glue this on top so that you can flip it open like that. Okay, and then make sure you color this as well. Okay. So going back to the slideshow. All right, so how the continents um, are, um, how they, how the continents, how they move. So we're going to take notes again, just like we did for the other ones. All right. All right, so the continents move. All right. So I'm just going to go ahead and take notes here. I'm not going to... Um, title my notes from each slide. So I'm just going to do the bullet points. So the first bullet point I'm going to put in my page is a million years ago the continent were connected and it was called Pangea. Okay, so go ahead and, oops, sorry about that, you guys. So I went ahead and I wrote my notes there at the top, as you can see right there. Okay, and you can see on the slide that's what Pangea looked like or what they think Pangea looked like before everything moved apart. All right, so there are seven continents, so you're not going to need to write them down because they're already written down for you. Okay, so they're already written down for you. So you have North America, South America, Europe, Africa, Asia, um, Australia. They call it Oceania, but it's actually Australia, and then Antarctica. And it is our Australia on your map. Okay. All right. Okay, so tectonic plates. So if you're in science class with me, we kind of talked a little bit about what tectonic plates are. I'm not going to get into a whole lot of detail. Okay. But I am going to take some notes on it. So tectonic plates. Okay. All right. And they float on top of molten rock okay north america moves away from europe okay. atlantic ocean is getting bigger. Pretty cool, huh? All right, so I went ahead and I put my notes right there at the bottom. All right, and so yes, apparently Atlantic Ocean is getting bigger, which means that chances are that the Pacific Ocean is getting smaller. <laughs> okay, all right. All right, and that is it for um, 
the continents. All right, so that's the information you need for the continents. All right, we'll see you later.